it's an honor to be a Leatherneck. Um, I love um, playing a sport here and um, knowing other kids that play sports and that the student body knows us as people that play sports and people that they can get to know. And it's a great honor to be a part of this great tradition to be a Leatherneck. Uh, we're a unique group of people. Uh, we have a unique uh, tradition and it's something that we can all be proud of. Being a Leatherneck definitely means having pride in your school and I'm very proud to be a Leatherneck showing support to other athletes, to other people on campus, whether it's students, staff, directors, and also just chanting our fight song at any chance I get because then that just pumps me up and hopefully pumps everybody else up. Uh, just, to, just to never give up, to always have fight in you and that if, if everybody believes and everybody's on the same page that anything is possible and if everybody just keeps working hard we can accomplish all the goals and all the dreams that we want to accomplish. I've had coaches and players on both sides after the game come up and shake my hand and say thank you for all the work that you've done, for all the effort that you've put in, for coming out to the game. And I've heard that story from several other Purple Haze members and it's, it's great because you might not know somebody that's standing right next to you when you first get there, but by the end of the time, you're going to recognize all those people around campus. I wave and talk to Purple Haze members all the time, and I don't have any classes with any of them and wouldn't have met them under without the Purple Haze. The people around here that are just always going to support you, I mean, no matter what, they're going to be there for you. And when you know that you have great people around you, it's always going to give you that extra fight and extra motivation to just keep working so you can see them happy and they can see you happy as well. I like telling people um, that I play softball and then they have a positive reaction from that. Like we've heard you guys do really well and we heard you guys compete really well with all the teams. Um, so I like having a good reputation. I get a lot of support from coaches and from coaches that are outside my sport. Um, other people on my team and campus student body. It's just really exciting to know that there's so many people looking out for me. It's a, it's a great feeling to tell people that you play Division One football um, for a school that's got a great history in, in, in the league. And uh, also to be able to say that you're a Leatherneck, which is one of the most unique names in all of college football. When the student body comes to our games, we notice their faces and we know that they live with us. They live on our floors. They live, we eat, we eat with them at the same time. So um, it's good seeing them there and even when they come out like for an inning or so, like that still means a lot when they come. It's, uh, it's great to be in class some days and uh, you have a student come up to you and say, hey, great game on Saturday. And uh, you just, you feel that, that pride coming into you from another student. It shows that this is a university, that the university is made up of everybody. And it gives me a tremendous amount of pride to be able to be in that same room and, and to share that experience with somebody else that, you know, we might not ever, me and him might not have ever had that kind of relationship without athletics. One time we actually got somebody from another team to turn around and start yelling back at us and their coach came over and dragged him off and put him on the bench and that was that was kind of a, a sense of pride because at that point we had pulled their team apart and I think that was something that we all took a little bit of pride in and was just entertaining and funny all at the same time. We just need support through thick and thin, knowing that we have people to watch out for us and cheer for us if we're losing or winning and showing support for us. Uh, it would help us out if every student came out to, uh, to cheer us on for every conference game. It's great to have as many people out there as possible on game day and to hear, just hear the cheers and you, get, you feel the rumble on the field. It's a, it's a great feeling to have everybody out there supporting us. I mean, if, if we can just get the atmosphere, if, if students just, you know, come out and support us, they'll really, you know, start feeling the tradition as a whole. If, you know, everybody's surrounded, cheering for us, and that, that'll give us the extra boost that we need. You know, teams coming here, you know, feel a little intimidated when you see, you know, a nice crowd of people going against you and we're down two and we know we can dig in. We know we have our crowd with us. They're fighting with us and just, you know, leather next tradition just to keep pushing and we know we can get over that, that hump if they're, if they're there with us. I mean, as a student, game day is just exciting. From the time you get up in the morning to the time you get to the game, 
to the very last second that that clock ticks down, it's a chance to be excited. It's a chance to really show your Leatherneck pride and to just get out there and support all of our student athletes. You should, you should come out to a Leatherneck game. It is a lot of fun. There, there's going to be people there you know, you're going to meet new people. It's, it's an easy social event to come to, and it's free. At Western, you get to go to the, all of the games for free. And that's something that, as a college student, you don't have a lot of money. It, it, it helps supplement the entertainment.